Welcome to the vlog! <laughs> so this is all about my beach look makeup or my summer makeup. Um, a lot of you were asking online what I use and we just got back from a short trip in Batangas with of course the family. Um, I don't know if you noticed but I kind of got a little tan and I'm sunburned at the back. But anyway, what do I use when I go to the beach? To be honest, um, it's so kalat my makeup kit because when I go to the beach, I just bring this like this pouch, okay? The eyebrows, the cheek tint, I just just put everything inside. I have been through a lot of moisturizers and sunscreen. And what works for me, or and what's been working for me, if you've been following me in my vlogs for the past couple of years, and every time I do a makeup vlog, I always say that I use this. This is the Biore. This is a watery essence, and it just really does feel very watery. See? And then when you put it on your skin, it's not oily, it's not shimmery, and it just kind of just blends in. So it has that matte effect, which I really, really like. I'm gonna zoom in my face. Look at all my freckles. Look. Ooh, scary. That's the freckles on my face. I'm dumb. Another one that I love also, aside from this Biore, this is not sponsored by the way, I just really love like... Um, Japanese brands. Well, I don't know if it's a Japanese brand, but because it's just Japanese at the back. This is one item that I also love. It's called Anessa. Um, Anessa and Biore have a lot of different kinds of sunscreen. These are the, my favorite versions and my favorite kinds. So this Anessa, you have to really shake it because if not, oil's just gonna come out. This one naman has that silky feeling when you put it. It's also very nice. So anyway, whatever it is, I recommend these two sunscreens. Let me know what you guys use. When you put like beach makeup, you don't like to put a lot of foundation because you still want your skin to come out. Maybe just conceal a couple if you have like um, dark spots or if you have if you want to conceal your eye bag. You don't want to like put foundation in your whole face because for me, that's what the summer skin or the summer glow is all about, which is really enhancing your skin already. Okay, so the next thing and the most important thing is your eyebrows, right? When I buy eyebrow pencils, I try to get a little bit lighter than my natural hair because I don't want it too dark and binabagayan ko siya with my hair color. And if you're gonna go swimming, you have to buy that tattoo. For me, this is the K palette. This is what I use when I go swimming. But when I get up from swimming, nandyan pa rin siya. So the nice thing about this K palette, it's a three-way thing. So there's a pencil. Okay, wait, let me push it down first. You also have the powder to fill in. Um, this is the one that you brush and fix your eyebrows with. Okay, so let me shape my eyebrows first. Uh, I just trace under because I still want it to look natural. Like makeup artists recommend, they said. Start from under because usually mga tao, what they do is that they trace above first, right? They try to shape it above. But they said, start at the bottom, make your way up. And with a pencil, so now I'm gonna use the powder just to fill it up. What is it? <laughs> See, that's what I love about this. You just twist it and then the powder's inside. At least when you go to the beach, you just need to just bring this whole thing and you don't need mga extra bubut. So there you go. That's my eyebrows. I kind of still want it to look natural, not too shaped. Because again, we're going for that all natural summer look. I don't want makeup. Okay, so next thing that I use um, is my cheek tint. I have different colors of cheek tint and I love Glossier. This one, I use the orange one if you kind of want to look like you have a tan. And this one is if you want to look like parang nakainom ka or like you're just tipsy. <laughs> so let's go for the orange one. Hi, GP. Hi. Wait, look what I'm doing, oh. Doing like a makeup tutorial. Say hi. Okay, bye. Bye. I've been using this for a very, very, very long time. And it's a little bit pricey, but it's super sulit. I use my middle finger to just tap. And they always say, you see your eyeball, so when you look forward, you start here, and then you go out. And then you make it pataas. Do you see it? I think I need to add. Start here, and then go up, okay? You want a little bit more natural. If you have tira, you do like this from your nose. <laughs> so it's just kind of like looking like you have a tan, right? Which I am. This is not sponsored, by the way, but 
Um, I really like K palette. I have the eyeliner that I used recently when I went to on my Boracay trip because I don't like putting mascara anymore because many times it smudges. So even if they say it's waterproof, it's smudge pa rin siya. Unless you know a mascara that doesn't smudge, please let me know. Okay, so this one is super, super thin. So this is my eyes without the eyeliner. And I'm gonna put eyeliner now, but you see. Can you see it? It's just super thin. This is how thin it is. Then you can just adjust later on if you want to put more or if you want to put that wing tip. There you have it. This is my eye with the eyeliner. This is my eye without the eyeliner. Okay, let's zoom in. Very easy. With eyeliner, without eyeliner. So this is more of the natural look that I go for all the time. And if you want, you can just add like eyeliner here or mascara, add whatever you want. And then for the lipstick, I like the Sunnies. Um, this is Baked. There you go. Basically, this is how I put my makeup. If you want to add more, you can go for mascara. And this is what I use. I use the Maybelline Hyper Curl Volume Express. This is oh, waterproof. And then if you want to have that glowy effect, I use this Glossier Dew Effect Highlighter. Um, I've had this for a very, very long time as well. I like it because it's moisturizing and then also you can control the shimmer in your face but you don't look like a disco ball when you go out of the sun. Don't put it straight to your face. Um, I suggest you put it in your hand first. See, nice. So, look. Get it with your hands, your two hand fingers, and then you just tap it here. There you go. And then here, and then here, and then here, and then there you go. So even if I have a huge bag that I bring all the time, wherever I go, um, there are just a few items that I use when I go to the beach or want to have like an all-natural look for summer, and this is it. If you want to add shimmer also to your eyes or you want to have um, a little bit of color, you can use the sunnies for a little color in your eye eyeshadow. You can also add the shimmer, um, this Glossier shimmer here, which I think I will do. add it here. We're really going for that dewy, summery look. There you have it. I like finishing it up with the rose water that my mom actually makes. It's from Bath Origins. So I like putting a facial mist and I like bringing this with me because sometimes when it's so hot and you just want to freshen up, um, I just spray this. And it's so bon. This is what my mom makes. So there you have it. This is the all natural summer look that I like doing. Products will be listed down below if you guys are interested to know what I used. So yeah, so that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and let me know if you guys have any recommendations for sunblock, mascara. Okay, anyway, I'm gonna go. Bye guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And thank you so much for just hanging out with me in this vlog. Okay, bye.